Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for stopping by and watching our previous video about top 10 anime from Madhouse Studio. Before we get started, be sure to hit the like button and ring the notification bell for more videos. Here's the list of top 10 anime from Madhouse Studio Part 2 you need to watch in your leisure time. We hope you enjoy this. Number 10 is High School of the Dead. One of the best apocalyptic zombie anime ever. High School of the Dead is an anime produced by Madhouse Studio. It was adapted from a Japanese manga series written by Daisuke Sato and illustrated by Shoji Sato. It was serialized in Fujime Shiba's Monthly Dragon Age between the September 2006 and May 2013 ages, but was left unfinished following Daisuke Sato's death in March 2017. At said and present day Japan, beginning as the world is tugged by a deadly pandemic that turns humans into zombies. The story follows a group of high school students and the school's nurses as they deal with a worldwide catastrophic event known as the outbreak. Number 9 is Ore Monogatari. Ore Monogatari, also called as My Love Story, is an anime adapted from a Japanese romantic comedy manga series written by Kazune Kawahara and illustrated by Abriko. The manga was serialized in Shueisha's Besatsu Margaret magazine. An anime television adaptation by Madhouse began airing in spring 2015 with a total of 24 episodes. Not only having an anime adaptation, it has a live action too. The story follows Takeo Goda, a tall and muscular high school student who doesn't have much luck with women, as every girl he likes ends up pulling for his best friend Makoto Zunakawa, who is charming and good looking. This all changes when he saves Rinko Yamato, a petite shy girl who, above all other expectations, falls in love with Takeo, beginning a unique love story. Number 8 is Mahoka Koko no Retose. Mahoka Koko no Retose, better called as the Irregular Magic High School, as an anime adapted from a Japanese web novel series by Satomu Sato. It was published on Shosetsu Kaninara, an internet web novel website, between October 2008 and March 2011. Sato reached a deal with Dangeki Banko and began releasing his work in a light novel format beginning in July 2011. The story takes place in an alternate history where magic exists and is polished through technology. However, the ability to use magic is determined by genetics, limiting the number of magicians in existence. Following the 20-year-long Third World War that reduced the world's population to 3 billion, the world's superpowers shifted to these four nations, the United States of North America, New Soviet Union, the Great Asian Alliance, and Japan. The story follows Tatsuya Shiba, a bodyguard to his sister Miyuki Shiba who is also a candidate to succeed the leadership of the Yotsuba clan, one of the ten master clans that govern Japan's magicians. The story will follow their daily lives while hiding their true identities. Number 7 is Hajime no Ippo One of the best parts of the anime of its time, probably to date. Hajime no Ippo is an anime produced by Madhouse Studio which was aired in fall 2000 with a total of 75 episodes adapted from a Japanese boxing-themed manga series written and illustrated by George Marikawa. It has been serialized by Kodansha and Weekly Shonen Magazine since October 1989 and collected into 130 Tangibon in March 2021. The story follows a young man who starts his boxing career and slowly makes his way to the highest peaks in the world of boxing. Epo Makunochi is a very shy high school student who is unable to make friends as he is always busy helping his mother run their family's fishing rental business. However, Epo's motivation to live slowly changes since his meeting with Mamoru Takamura which may soon change his life. Number 6 is Nana Nana is an anime produced by Madhouse Studio. It's adapted from a Japanese manga series written and illustrated by Aizawa. 
It was serialized in Cooking Magazine from July 2000 until June 2009 when it went on indefinite hiatus. With almost all its chapters collected into 21 tankable volumes published by Suisha. The series derives its title from the name of the two main characters, both of whom are called Nana. Nana Komatsu is a small town girl who goes to Tokyo to follow her boyfriend and college friends, with the hope of having her dream life. While Nana Oseki was in a popular punk rock band in her hometown, she goes to Tokyo with the goal of making it big as a singer. The two Nanas met on the train ride to the city. Later, they run into each other again when they happen to check out the same apartment, and the girls decide to become roommates. The series chronicles their friendship and their lives as it chases her dreams. Number 5 is Betum. Betum is an anime aired in fall 2012 with a total of 12 episodes adapted from a Japanese manga series written and illustrated by Junya Inoue. It has been released in weekly comic bunch since 2009 and later in monthly comic bunch with chapters collected into 26 tangible volumes as of 2018. Betum follows the adventures of Ryota Sakamoto, an unemployed and isolated young man who is one of the world's top players in the titular video game. After Ryota is nominated to participate in the real-life version of the game, he becomes trapped inside it and meets his love interest, Hamiko, who is his in-game wife. With the help of their fellow players, Ryota and Hamiko must find a way to return home. Number 4 is Chihaya Furu. Released primarily in fall 2011 with a total of 25 episodes, Chihaya Furu aired the second season not long after the first season released. It's a Japanese Jose manga series written and illustrated by Yuki Suetsuko. It has been serialized in Kudansha's Bill of Magazine since December 2007. It's about a schoolgirl, Chihaya Ayase, who is inspired by a new classmate to take up Hakunin Ishikarita competitively. Chihaya Ayase is a girl who has spent most of her life simply supporting her sister. She doesn't have any motivation for herself until she met with a boy named Arata Wataya. Chihaya slowly gets out of her comfort zone and begins to take on a new dream to become Japan's best character player. Number 3 is Wolf Children. Wolf Children, also known as Okami Kodemo no Ame to Yuki, is a 2012 Japanese anime film produced by Madhouse Studio which is directed and co-written by Mamoru Hosoda. This is the second original feature film directed by Hosoda, and the first work written by him. The film depicts 13 years in the life of a young woman, Hana, who falls in love with a werewolf while in college and following his death must raise the resulting half-wolf, half-human siblings, Ame and Yuki, who grow and find their own paths in life. And Tokyo, college student Hana, falls in love with an enigmatic man. The man reveals that he can transform into a wolf, and the latter have two werewolf children, a daughter, Yuki, and a son, Ame. To raise Yuki and Ame, Hana must hide the fact that they are werewolves. Number 2 is Monster Monster is a Japanese manga series written and illustrated by Naoki Urasawa. It was published by Shiga Kikan in that big comic original magazine between 1994 and 2001. The story revolves around a Japanese surgeon living in Germany whose life enters turmoil after getting himself involved with his former patients who is revealed to be a dangerous serial killer. Urasawa later wrote and illustrated the novel Another Monster, a story detailing the events of the manga from an investigative reporter's point of view. Kensu Tenma is a young Japanese brain surgeon working at Eisler Memorial Hospital in Düsseldorf, West Germany. One day, he had patients named Johann and Anna Liebert coming to the hospital. However, this is the beginning of a terrible fate that will probably hit Tenma without him noticing. Number 1 is Perfect Blue Perfect Blue is the 1997 Japanese animated psychological thriller film directed by Satoshi Kon and written by Sadayuki Murai. 
its best on the novel Perfect Play Complete Metamorphosis. The film follows Mima Kirigoi, a member of a Japanese idol group who retires from music to pursue an acting career. As she becomes victim of stalking, bruises and murders begin to occur, and Mima starts to lose her grip on reality. Mima Kirigoi, a member of a mightily successful J pop group named Charm, decides to leave the group. She is joined by her longtime manager and former pop idol Rumi Hidaka and her agent Taito Koro. Slowly, terrible things begin to happen to Mima and the people around her. Being stalked makes her traumatic. Her growing obsession with Mima's room leads her to begin suffering from psychosis. Well, that's the list of the top 10 anime from Madhouse Studio Part 2. Do you have any favorite anime on the list? If you do, let us know by writing in the comment section below. Be sure to hit the like button and share this video as much as you can to your friends if you really enjoy this. Thanks a lot for watching and see you next time.